Princess Kate Middleton seems to be following in the late Princess Diana's fashionable footsteps. The 40-year-old royal attended Remembrance Sunday yesterday with her husband, Prince William, her father-in-law, King Charles, and his wife, Queen Consort Camilla, and they paid respect to Britain's fallen soldiers. The Princess of Wales donned a black wraparound coat with a drop brim black hat and three poppies on her lapel, which resembled Princess Diana's look from the same event. Kate also added another meaningful touch to her look as she wore South Sea pearl earrings that previously belonged to her late mother-in-law. Princess Kate is no stranger to wearing jewelry from Princess Diana's collection, as the sapphire engagement ring Prince William gave to her was once always worn by his mother. Princess Diana isn't the only late royal Kate seems to emulate through her fashion choices. On Saturday, Kate paid tribute to Queen Elizabeth through her jewelry. At the Royal British Legion's Festival of Remembrance on Saturday night, the princess wore two pieces that once belonged to the late queen, pearl drop earrings and a four-strand pearl choker. Kate notably wore both items to her late grandmother-in-law's funeral this past September. Access Hollywood previously spoke with DailyMail.com's Charlie Langston about how Will and Kate are stepping up things up in order to one day be the head of the monarchy. Kate and William are really kind of stepping up to the plate as far as leading the monarchy. Now, William is not the next in line to the throne. His father, Prince Charles, is going to be the next monarch in the United Kingdom. However, William and Kate are very much already in that kind of waiting in the wings role where they are both very much aware that they will be on the throne probably, you know, not too far in the future. I think they both know that Prince Charles is not a young spring chicken. He's not the age that Elizabeth was when she became queen. And I don't think anyone is expecting Prince Charles to sit on the throne for decades and decades to come. He will absolutely take on the role because he has been waiting his entire life to become king. But I think that his reign in comparison with the queens will be very short lived. William and Kate are already not acting as though they are already the leaders of the monarchy, but they are taking on a huge amount of responsibility, not just in terms of public engagements, but also in terms of the way in which the monarchy is run. They're making small but very important changes, opening up the monarchy to a more modern point of view, not perhaps in a way that is noticeable every single day, but bit by bit, they have kind of helped the monarchy to evolve, to kind of embrace new traditions, and to kind of maintain the important heritage of the past, while also kind of saying, okay, a few of the things that we used to do are seen as being very stuffy. They are very stuffy. Here are ways where we can kind of maintain the tradition behind these things, without making it appear as though we are completely ignorant to what the rest of the world is doing and how they're living.